Matthew Stafford of the Rams, competing without the top target week one. Even though top witty out Cooper Cup has been ruled out for the season opener, Stafford is comfortable with the passing game weapons that will be surrounding him for Sunday's game in Seattle, according to Stu Jackson of the Rams' official website. Cooper missed a portion of training camp as well, so we needed some new players to step up and make plays for us, which they have, according to Stafford. Through joint practices, practicing against our defense, we've had a lot of guys step up and make some great plays, and total trust in everybody that's put out there to go out there and make plays. Over perhaps no quarterback over the past two seasons has been more dependent on one pass receiver than Stafford on Cup. Cup has garnered a staggering 32% of the quarterback's targets in the 25 regular season games the two have played together. Stafford believes the witty out group of Van Jefferson, Tutu Atwell, Puka Nakua, and Ben Skaronek, as well as tight end Tyler Higby, can skillfully absorb the vacated targets and ensure the passing attack remains productive. However, the Rams won't rely on any of their other pass catchers to fill Cup's high-volume role on offense alone. While Stafford's assurance in his group of pass catchers may provide some comfort, fantasy managers in clubs that start just one quarterback may be better suited retaining the quarterback they have. Week 1 saw the 35-year-old on the bench and without his preferred option.